In a territorial dispute with Russia over the Pacific archipelago of the southern Kuril Islands, Japan's government has reaffirmed its claims. Japan lost the islands to the Soviet Union after its surrender in World War II. Tokyo is now trying to reclaim the since-occupied islands of Atorofu on the dividing line between the Sea of Okhotsk and the Pacific Ocean. Foreign Minister Yoshimasa Hayashi described the four islands as an integral part of Japan, and previously this wording had only been used by Prime Minister Fumio Kishida. In light of Russia's aggressiveness against Ukraine, Kishida's government is reverting to terminology that Kishida's predecessor, Shinzo Abe, avoided for 10 years in the hope of achieving a bargain with Russian President Vladimir Putin. Proposals to return two of the four contested islands as a temporary measure were also rejected. During his time in office, Abe avoided using the phrase integral part of Japan in order to signal a more flexible stance in the dispute with Russia in the hopes of achieving a historic breakthrough. According to analysts, Kishida's return to the old terminology today suggests that he is saying farewell to that hope. The issue between the two countries continues to delay the signing of a peace deal between Japan and Russia.